Hello, Kyle Nedenriff here with another edition of Recruiting Central here at IndyStar.com. A uh, special edition today, we're talking about the 2011 class uh, with a special guest, Austin Etherington of Hamilton Heights, an Indiana recruit. And Austin, you know, you look at this 2011 group, very deep, very good. You know, Indiana stacks up pretty much with about any, uh, any state in the country when you, when you take a long look at the depth and the talent in this 2011 class. Yeah, it's, uh, it's definitely one of the top ones in, that's been through Indiana, so... Who are some of those top guys? I know you uh, have played with a lot of these guys. Uh, you know, Cody Zeller, Jeremiah Davis are on your uh, Indiana Elite summer team. Mm -hmm. uh, who, who do you kind of look at in this in this class as maybe some of the top guys? Well, yeah, like you said, uh, Jeremiah and Cody, they're both great players. And then you got to think of uh, Michael Chandler, Ryan Taylor, Brandon Dawson, you know, those guys who uh, who are all great players and just on different parts of the state. And uh, all of us are out there just trying to, uh, get our names out and go to the best colleges we can. Now I'm going to go through some of the, the top three guys on our list, and we've got Marcus Teague from Pike at yeah. number one on this list, going to Kentucky. Uh, I know you've had a chance to play against him. What makes him uh, such a tough uh, tough ball player? He uh, has the best ball handling skills I've ever seen. He, uh, I don't know anyone out there that can guard him on the, on the ball, but um, he, he's definitely uh, one of the top penetrators I've ever seen. Now, I've also got uh, Michael Chandler on this list. Uh, I know you've had a chance to see him as well. Uh, good post player, and there's yes. a lot of good post players in this class. But yeah, what, there are. What makes him so tough? Uh, he's just a big body, and for how big he is, and has great footwork and good hands, so that's a, a plus for him. Now, a guy you've uh, we talked about earlier off camera, uh, Cody Zeller, plays with you, yep. uh, Indiana Elite team. Uh, Cody sounds like from what you've said is really developing his outside game as yeah. well and is that maybe the most impressive part of his game now oh uh, yeah probably just because no one for how tall he is and how well he can shoot the ball most uh big guys aren't aren't uh capable to, of guarding that and so it makes him so good now i know you were kind of battling a back injury but uh sounds like you're back and healthy now how has yeah. that gone for you it's uh good um no problems anymore still uh wearing my brace you know all the time but that's a, that's about it with that now, what do you have going on? July, obviously, a big month. And, of course, being committed to IU, maybe not as big for you to, to show coaches what you can do. But uh, where are you guys going, and what are you, kind of your uh, plans for the summer? Um, we're starting out the year um, with the Adidas tournament in Indianapolis, and then we're going to Louisville and uh, Vegas at the end of the month. Now, do you feel what, – what are kind of your goals for the month? Or, I mean, do you just kind of go in with the idea, I'll just yeah, play I as just, well as I can? I just try to go out and uh, – you know, represent Indiana as best as I can and uh, just try to keep improving in all aspects of my game and uh, trying to trying to prove myself and, you know, and, yeah, that's pretty much and now you're uh, you're going to IU obviously, and and uh, IU has struggled the last couple of years. And you've we've talked about it in the past. You're you're kind of trying to be a recruiter now for some yeah. of these other guys. Uh, what what are your uh, uh, thoughts on where the program's going, and and uh, and what are your kind of hopes for uh, maybe la helping land a couple of these other guys? Yeah, it's it's definitely on the rise. Uh, most people are seeing that, especially since uh, IU did go through some struggles in the past years, and then last year losing Matt Roth and. Uh, Maurice Creek mm -hmm. both those guys are uh, Matt's playing all the time now and Maurice is um, almost there back and uh, most people uh, questioned him last year but they they lost two of their best scores and so that that hurts any program mm -hmm. what what are the the guys you talk to your friends what do they uh, what do they tell you when you kind of talk about IU do they seem receptive to uh, you know to go in there yeah because most people do see the change that's going on uh, there's some people out there who try to say, you know, IU, they aren't very good, but they got to think back what they're, uh, like, where they are now compared to, you know, the last couple of years. So most people see the plus about uh, IU program. And, and I know for you, uh, you play kind of a wing position. Mm -hmm. what, what do you feel like maybe going into college, you know, you've got some time here going into your senior year, and I'm sure things you want to do team-wise, individual-wise, but maybe what are some aspects of your game you feel like you need to improve on this just, year? Uh, definitely my ball handling. Just got to keep getting better at that. There's uh, always room to improve when it comes to that. And uh, just my shooting still, you know, it's, it can always get better and just keep staying low in my defense. Well, we thank Austin for coming in today. Uh, Austin will be playing, like I said, with Hamilton Heights uh, this summer and with Indian Elite throughout uh, July. Actually, the first tournament is, is here, the big one, uh, June, July 6th to the 8th. 
uh, the Adidas tournament will be mostly at North Central, but various yeah. places around the city. Uh, so if you want to come and check him out and check out a lot of uh, teams from all over Indiana and all over the country, really, uh, that'll be a good uh, opportunity for that. But thank Austin for being here. This is another edition of uh, Recruiting Central here at IndyStar.com. And uh, the 2011 rankings will be up uh, later uh, today, so you can check those out as well.